and hello again, it is I, Kamikaze, here to continue playing Life is Strange. Um, we're just now so taking Chloe I and get the hell out of this, uh, party, which is way too redundant. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs. Wait, he's, he's back here? Can't he? There's alcohol over there. It looks bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> Are you both now. okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. But I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole cage situation. Oh, yeah, shit. That makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. What the hell what are you gonna do? Left? Sing and dance? Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I appreciate well, I it. I, getting his pants. I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. And I could have taken that away from him, couldn't I? Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Who won? Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! You, you didn't even open oh it. Oh my, up. what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Yay! I'm so excited. I am happy for you, Victoria. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name <coughs> and fame. <coughs> I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. You didn't practice this at all. And I'd like to dedicate this prize I want to, to push her into the, pool the memory of Kate Marsh. She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. She's using her. Thank you. For you suck, uh, Victoria. There we go. Victoria won. Thank you, Victoria. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Because she did. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. So wait. Think, 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 think. So she really was blackmailing and threatening him? Oh, Christ. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. What? Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Wait, how does he know what was going on? Whoa, wait. Is like one reality disappearing? Or one possible option or something? Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Yeah, I don't think you can rewind if I get a bullet through my brain. That flashlight does not reach very far. We control it. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, yes. Ugh. There we go. Run away. I don't want to go that way. No. Oh. Quick, grab the med kit. No, that's not a med God, kit. I'm gonna fucking right. kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't focus if you're yelling. Please. Something I can set up around here as a trap. Come on, come on. Nathan needs to die now. Oh, for God's like sake, Chloe, you here. have to be quiet. We could die, okay? I can just walk around. Okay, I guess there's nothing. You okay? We need to hurry and get that motherfucker. 
Whoa, hello, Mr. Mousy Rat thingy. Please don't bite me. And there's an owl. Holy crap. Give me a heart attack. Suffer, Nathan. Whew. Okay. He's gotta be around here somewhere. So creepy out here. You think we came out here in the middle of the night? You thought this was a good idea? Max, please hurry! The body's gone. Or he's just trying to bury us all here. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. And behind you. Oh, oh fuck, oh. I knew it. Can't rewind, can't rewind, can't rewind. Chloe, look out. What the fuck? <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not. I fucked up. Chloe. I fucked up bad. But what could I have done differently? Whoa, wait. I knew it! Oh my fucking god! I knew he was creepy! Since the beginning! But no! What the hell? What the fuck? He was just like too nice of a guy and I couldn't figure out any, there was no evidence leading, linking toward him, but, but that explains why he was in the Vortex Club and not caring about the alcohol uh, and the drugs that were going on right around him. Oh my freaking, what the hell, he just shot Chloe and I couldn't rewind. I had to have fucked up bad. Oh, so bad. I hear I thought I was... Oh, no, 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 no. Would have been better if I wasn't invited to the Vortex Club party. What, what, holy crap. Why? Is he the drug dealer? No, because the other guy was a drug dealer, giving Nathan drugs. What's his purpose? Was he the photographer? Was Nathan... Was there two people involved? Nathan supplied the drugs. And... Wait. Nathan supplied the drugs to him in order for him to get his rocks off with those photos being a famous photographer because those binders those binders looked familiar when we were in there and I thought it was just weird that they looked like the ones inside of his classroom the ones that were keeping track with the names on there the handwriting was probably even the same so it's his collection his morbid collection it's his fault Kate is dead that's why he didn't care. Holy crap. What would have happened if I didn't warn Victoria? What I wouldn't have... Holy... Another person's dead. People just keep dying. Is there a way of having everyone live? Could I have saved Kate? Well, I couldn't have saved her because she was, uh, the, 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 Rachel, because she was dead before the game even started. But that, oh my, why, 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 why,
Why is he doing this? Just for his own morbid pleasure? Was there some kind of end game? It it My head is exploding. The possibilities are ridiculous, but wait, wait. They got a text saying that the evidence was going to be gone, which means that he had to have followed them there. So if she had the gun taken away from her, would she have still been alive? Would we both have been kidnapped? If she didn't have the gun, could that have saved her? There are so many possibilities that I don't know how I'll be able to play all the different endings to this game. But Chloe's dead! There's a whole nother chapter! That's... It feels like I have the game is over at chapter 4. I am screwed. I have been drugged. Why did he just drug me instead of just shoot me then shoot Chloe? Well, we know that when you're high, you can't use your superpower of rewinding time. But how we we, we need to rewind and stop Chloe from dying. But how? Everything led toward Nathan. But maybe I should have been looking somewhere else. Because I've been picking on Nathan the entire time in his complete dementness, evil bastardness. Maybe those things were all planted. But that land was owned by Sean Prescott. So it would have had to have been Nathan. And all the evidence of the drugs pointed to him. Even the drug dealer had the information that pointed toward Nathan. Nathan has to be involved. There's no way around that. There has to be some way around that. Is he some kind of super mad genius that just led me on a goose chase throughout this entire thing? Making me find certain things. Does he have a power? Does he have a rewind power and can and it's been manipulating me every step of the way? I'm now I don't want to enter in my freaking photo. Fuck his hero thing. Guy needs to be hit by a bus randomly. Thanks for crying. Thank you. <laughs> Up yours. I'm trying hard not to cry at that, because that's not fair. So, up yours. But no, there's just no way. She can't be, she can't be dead. I'm doing a good job this time not crying, because Chloe's dead. But stupid, what the, I am, oh, ah. Okay, I refused Chloe's request. That made no difference. Because she died anyway. Well, she would have not died before. And yes, I let Warren beat him up. No one got hurt. And that was great, because that was good. And it could have wounded him in two different ways. Hey, she believed it because I was a good person. Let's see what else we got. I saved the Blue Jay. I did not disturb the blues, the, the bird's nest. I... Didn't know there was a bird's nest. But it's good I didn't disturb it, because that may have caused problems. I found David's code. I remembered David's code, except for I remembered the numbers all jumbled. <laughs> Kate couldn't have helped me. There was no way. No way. She was dead. I am glad I didn't motivate him to go to the Vortex Club party. That... Probably would have been bad. Probably would have gotten pushed in the pool or something. Warren's... Oh, I could have left him a message? Because you are cute. Using periodic table elements. 
Would it have mattered if I figured out Nathan's pin code? And of course I helped Alyssa. But shit. She's dead. I'm fucked. Her best friend just got shot in the head. There is a bullet hole between her eyes. That's bullshit. Damn it. I fucked up again. My choices suck. And I'm one chapter away. I'm going to cause the end of humanity. Oh man, I'm assuming that there is that <clears throat> that there's multiple endings to this game, but it's fucking with me so bad. Okay, exit. A fucker, you fucker! God, no. He's gonna kill me. He went after me first. Does he know? Does he know I have a power? And what's with the photograph? I tore that up and left it on the trash. And yes, those files! Those files! I fucking said those files! I thought he was just, you know, bulk supply store. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, I'm done. Do what normal end video things do. And my brain is gone. I'll see you folks in the, in the next one.